Hey there Lickin' Riffers and welcome back to yet another awesome finger style lesson here on Lickin' Riff in which I'm gonna teach you how to slap in different time signatures. Okay, you asked me this uh, several times. I've made several slapping okay, technique lessons on Lickin' Riff uh, so far, but this is a really good question. When to slap in different, in different time signatures? So um, usually when I teach slapping, Okay, in the previous uh, lessons on slapping, we did it in 4-4 four, four time. Okay, where the slap is usually at 2, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4. Okay, you slap at the 2 and the 4. Okay? The bass usually comes around on the one and the three, so it's bass, slap, bass, slap. Now, I'm playing the bass with the chord. So the slap is usually at the two. Okay? Even if you okay, slap and play at the same time. Okay? I also made a lesson on that. So okay? One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Right, so it's on the two and the four, but we've covered that already. Now, when it comes to three, four time or six, eight time, okay, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. It's on the one, just on, okay, you have the bass on the first one and the slap on the second one, okay? Or if you're going at one, two, three, four, five, six, then you're slapping on the four. So it's one, two, three, four, Five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, so it's on the four. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, you see, on the four. Now, what happens if you want to give it a little more pizzazz, right? And you have uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six, okay? It's the same thing. Only faster. Okay, so it's on the four. One, two, three, four, five, six. Now, what happens if you're in odd time signatures, okay? By the way, all of this is uh, is covered in the fingerstyle technique toolbox course. Okay, if uh, you're one of those who aren't aware that I have courses, in-depth courses, the fingerstyle technique toolbox course is a part of the complete guitar freedom journey. Okay, my advanced course. If you're not ready for that, I have the ultimate beginner guitar course as well, a seven hour beginner guitar course. But if you want more advanced techniques and more advanced, uh, advanced ear training techniques and rhythm techniques and fingerstyle techniques and composition and soloing techniques, I have the complete guitar freedom journey. Okay, so for the beginners, you have the ultimate beginner course. For the advanced or intermediate players, I have the complete guitar freedom journey. You can get the courses individually. You don't have to buy the whole thing, but if you buy the whole thing, you get the electric mastermind pack as well as a bonus. So uh, go check it out. Okay, the links are below in the description, right? So let's continue talking about time signatures. Now, if you have, let's say, um, let's say a five, four time signature. Hey, um, hey, if you don't know what a 5-4 time signature, it's, uh, it's Mission Impossible. Okay? Um, it's also Take 5 by Dave Brubeck, but maybe you're not a jazz aficionado, so you probably know Mission Impossible. So it's... Okay, so it's... It's one of the uh, oldest arrangements here on Lick and Riff. Okay, I have a full finger style arrangement for that. If you want to slap during the the chord progression, okay, the chord progression is G5 and then B flat five and C5. 
and then it's G5 again. And then it's F, F sharp. Okay? All power chords. Okay? So if you want to slap, okay, you slap where there is a sort of a sort of a break in the riff. Okay? That's something that you have to decipher for every riff that you're playing. But in this riff, it's bum, bum, psh, okay? and then slap. Okay? Okay? Um, it's weird, I know, because it's a weird time signature. It's 5-8. You can slap differently in different pieces. So let's take take five. Now the slapping here will probably come uh, around towards the end. Okay, with um, okay, it's a slap and strum. Because it fits the riff. It all depends on the riff when you're going uh, for odd time signatures. Um, odd time signatures always depend on the riff. Um, otherwise, it's just a, math a mathematical, uh, mathematical cerebral composition, and those aren't very interesting. The, the interesting compositions in odd time signatures usually heavily rely on the riff itself. <laughs> Okay, so um, let's try seven eight time. Okay, seven eight time uh, would be something like this. Da, 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 so that would be interesting. Let's take uh, an unexpected chord. Okay, let's take a. So again, it's kind of at, right after the beginning of the leg. Okay, so it's okay, so it's da, it's one two three one two one two. Okay, one two three one two three four one two three one two three four one two three one two one two one two three one two one two one. So it's yeah, you can do. Okay, and again, it's on the one. You have one, two, three, one, two, one, two. One, two, three, one, two, one, two. One, two, three, one, two, one, two. Okay, it's on the, uh, it's on the break, okay, where the break happens that connects the two halves together. Okay, that's, uh, that's, when, that, that's when you slap in this particular riff, in this particular rhythm pattern. Um, so... On 12-8 time, it's pretty much the same as the 6-8 time, only you do it twice. So it becomes 12-8 times. So if you're playing a slow blues... Okay, this was 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, twice, making this a 12-8 time, okay? Which is basically a 4-4 four, four time divided in threes. So it's one, two, three, two, two, three, three, two, three, four, two, three. Okay, it's one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, and then there's a new bar. So you do the same thing. It's one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Okay, one, two, three, slap, two, three, one, two, three, slap, two, three. No matter how you break the bar, how, how you break the the pattern that you're playing, uh, the slap will still uh, will still be there on the second beat. Here it's the second beat. It's the second and fourth beats, uh, but it's a combination of four four time and three four times. So that depends how you look at it. But it's a concept. 
Okay, so uh, before you go, make sure that you check the links in the description and you check out, if you're a beginner, you check out the Ultimate Beginner Guitar Course, a seven hour course to take you from complete beginner to an intermediate player. Okay, I guarantee it. Uh, check it out, it's at lickandref.com slash beginner. And if you're a more intermediate player uh, or even an advanced player, I have the Complete Guitar Freedom Journey Pack. Okay, it's 10 course modules. You can get each of them individually, but if you get three of them, you get seven of them for free. So uh, check it out, it's at lickandref.com slash courses. All right, so I will see you in the next lesson. Bye for now, thanks for watching.